Hey y'all, so this is what we're about to tackle. <clears throat> it's a old door with, I bet you that's uh, lead paint. It's flaking off, peeling off. And I want to introduce y'all to this high build peel bond. Now, Sir Williams makes a version. I'm sure that Benjamin Moore makes a version and Home Depot has their version. This is the Zinger, or they say Home Depot, say Zinger because that's what they sell. And this is the, uh, the Zinger triple thick uh, peel bond that I'm about to put on for you. I just kind of went around and scraped um, the loose paint. So I can't put the peel bond on today. Um, first, I don't know if you can see me. Um, first, we have to peel it. Make sure that you scrape off all the loose paint. But just as a, just so you can kind of see what's up, you know, I just want to kind of show you. I want to kind of show you what it does. Just on, you know, if you were to not scrape the loose paint, but you know, let's just show it a little test. I'm gonna scrape the loose paint, you know, but I just wanna kinda of do a little video to show you what it does if you don't scrape the loose paint. Now, wherever there's bare wood, you know, I, I think it's gonna just crack, but look, this is definitely lead paint. And then some people, you know, are really scared to get that in their yard or get that around the birth of the animals and, you know, walk around or whatever. So look, you're just going to, See how far it's peeling back? See, look at all that cracking and webbing paint right there. This right here is what peel bond is made for. This cracks. See? See it starting to peel up here. It's starting to crack and bubble and trying to peel. All down there. See here? Now, this is not what it's made for. You know, I have put it on stuff like this, where you, you rub your finger across it and the paint falls off. You put the peel bond on it, you know, and it holds it together. I'm just gonna go ahead and do this little spot for y'all, just to kind of give you, show you that you can put it on, watch. Just like that. Went right over that paint. Okay. I'm gonna sand that back off whenever I do my demonstration. But y'all seen that paint's just kind of flaking off, just falling off just by pushing my finger around. Right? So I just put the triple thick pill bond on it. We're gonna have a big run because there's a screw there. So I'm gonna take that out. Let's see if I can get that out of there. Yes, I can. We're gonna fill that big old hole right there with that triple thick peel bond also. So I just wanted to, boom, show y'all. You see that stuff was just falling off. It's not on the brush, you know. It went right over the peeling paint. All right, now, um, I think this is some kind of cedar, cypress, old door. So we're gonna oil base prime this, not gonna put the peel bond directly. Now, wherever there's paint, like this, I'll put the peel bond on that. But I got that bare wood right there. I don't really want to put it on that. And you don't want to be sanding on this paint. It, you know, the particles. That's what you don't want to do. But watch, see the big crack? See the big, the big fit, what we did? See there's, that panel is split twice. Boom, all the way across, boom, all the way across. We are gonna fill that in. See? It's gonna kinda of bed up. Now, sometimes it's really rough. You might have to do a couple of the coats. Let's shoot, let me back up and see what's going on here. Fill those cracks in. Yep. 
Okay, that's it. Now, that's basically, that's basically what you're after. You just wanna, every time the brush comes this way, it's gonna hit, uh, you know, a uh, high spot. It's gonna kind of bed it up, kind of float it out a little bit. A little bit on my YouTube. Yeah. You wanna check me out? Now let me do it on YouTube. Let me do it. L E M L E M I D U I T. Yeah. Let me first name. Do it last name. Yeah. Talking about this peel bond paint. Yeah. High build, triple thick peel bond paint. How you put it over the lead paint? See the lead paint's cracking. You don't want to. You don't want to be sanding on that. Right. I was about to say you can't sand on that. What it is though? L E M yeah. I yeah. space last name D U I T. Let me do it. Okay. All right. Yeah. Let me do it. Let me do it. Let me do it. Let me do it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we got all kinds of good videos up there, man. How to cut glass, how to cut plastic glass, and now we're doing this one on triple thick peel bond. Yeah, on magazine, <laughs> I seen a salvage and huh? Yep, that's it. Wood primer penetrates. Do not use the quick, fast drying oil based primer on wood. Make sure it says wood primer penetrate. It can't penetrate if it flash dries. It can't be a flash dry type of primer. Now, sometimes, usually, a lot of times, I'll put a little thinner in. You know, pour me a little th uh, primer into a cup and put me some thinner on it. But in this case, this situation, I don't, I'm, I wanna try to get that to build out as far as I can. You know, if it was like some smooth wood pine, sure. We would throw some uh, thinner in it and, you know, and stretch it out. It also, it just spreads easier when it's thin but here we're going to leave it the thickness that it is we're going to try to throw it on as heavy as we can without it running i'm gonna pack it up in these cracks see those splits are i'm gonna pack it up in there the best that i can heavy grit it's like 80 60 80 because i'm trying to knock that down See all the drips and runs that I can't really. I don't want anything. When I, when I leave, I don't want to be able to. I don't want to come back tomorrow and see those drips. It's easier to get it while it's wet. So always take the time to cover your tracks and get it while it's wet. I don't think we're going to have any drips there. So yeah, tomorrow I think we'll this door, you know, um, will be ready the paint i'm not trying to spend i'm not trying to make it beautiful i'm not trying to, i just don't want it to rot any further 
my instructions wasn't to bring this door back to beauty. My instructions was, you know, st paint it, get a coat on it, stop the door from rotting. So I just wanted to use this door just to kind of introduce that peel bond to you and um, show you how great it works. I hope y'all have enjoyed our uh, introduction to uh, high build peel bond climber. Uh, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, follow us along, keep checking us out. See you on the next one.